my name's Georgia, I'm from Wales. I work as an actress in an aquarium. And did you know fish are actually quite clever? They do have a memory longer than 30 seconds. Three, like three seconds, sorry. And um, you can actually train them. So one of my top tips for moving fish around is actually train them to go into a pot. So what we do is we feed the fish in the pot and then they're quite used to the environment that they're in which allows us to move them to separate tanks. So have a think about doing this with your fish when you're doing water changes or if you need to transfer them to other tanks guys. And thank you and I hope you enjoy my tip. Yeah. <laughs> Hi I'm Kat, I'm from Scotland. I work at a zoo. And did you know that um, even with the big cats that get trained at the zoo, you can also train your smaller cat at home as well. The recall um, training procedure really, really good. Sometimes when your cat's out in the garden, what you want to do is just recall it by t shaking the favourite um, treat bag. When it does come back, give it a wee treat, and then that means that it's going to be reinforced for coming back and having really, really nice things. So recall your cat, and that means that it'll come home every single time. Hi, my name is Marina, I'm from Spain, I'm a vet and my tip uh, for you is maybe you can take your, your animal to the vet one more, one more take the, the, the trip, sorry, take the trip, the toys and make something fun to go to the vet, not, not something um, that your pet is going to be like something wrong or they don't like it, so good. Hi, my name is Chirac, I'm an animal behaviourist and trainer from London and I, my top tip is about parrots. Now did you know if you take the time throughout the day to t go and tell your parrot that they're being really good, give them a favourite treat or a piece of fruit or veg when they're being good, when they're being quiet, when they're playing with themselves. <laughs> <laughs> when, they're <laughs> when they're being good or they're playing with their toys as opposed to when they're screaming. So if your parrot starts screaming, rather than telling them to be quiet or giving them attention of any kind, just ignore them, walk out the room. But if you see your parrot being quiet, that's the time to really give them information about how great they are. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>